Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, family. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. Uh, you know, I'm really, really, really disappointed and sick and tired of us as black folk. Um, always, always con- accusing one another of being agents. And most of y'all wouldn't know what a damn agent was if you tripped and fell over it. Okay? Most of the people that's out in this community, and when I say the community, I mean these YouTube streets that are taking your money, promising you pipe dreams, and giving you nothing in return but a feel-good sermon. Those are agent provocateurs. All right, that's those are masters of technology, okay, and hyperbole. That's what that is. And as black people, we got to get more sophisticated than that. Seriously, I mean, if we just want to be counted as a group of people that don't just operate in pain, because we in a lot of it, and I get it, and I understand it. I'm in it too. You ain't in it by yourself. But when we get to the point where you see the backbite, you see the envy, you see the destructive, destructive behavior of our so-called leaders and leadership. You, when you see this or who y'all deem as leaders, because see, the only person that I deem as a leader is myself. Oh, I might take information and listen to it from all over places, but ultimately, at the end of the day, the decision has to come from here and it has to come from and, and what should influence my decision is people that are doing the work, not running a mouth or who have put in the work, not just running a mouth. And it seems that we don't seem to know the difference. We are so sad. We are taken by every hustler, swindler, pimp. Pseudo uh, scientists, uh, 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 whatever. That somebody talk a good game and automatically we off to lead them and following behind them. You know, you know, and you know, and it's so sad because you ever heard of that saying? You cut off your nose and spite your face. That's us. We are politically retarded when you have some people say, don't vote and turn your gun back in. But yet still, I mean, those are the most important things, directives that we are given from the dominant society in terms of as ADOS. Gun buyback programs and your right to vote. Most of the time it's suppressed. Okay. And some of y'all are so um, just politically immature that you really feel like your vote don't matter. It does. We just need all fronts, every all hands on deck. From every unit, from every category. Y'all always talk about what Dr. Fresh Francis said about the nine, uh, 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 the nine separate, uh, systems that operate in white supremacy in our lives. So that means we need all hands on deck in every one of those, uh, categories. Every category that's named is, is the category we need somebody fighting in. So everything has its place. Don't be so quick to down your brothers and because you're not doing what they're doing. You want to talk bad about them and saying, um, you know, they're uh, FBI agents or whatever. Let me tell y'all something. I work with a lot. I, I've been in, uh, unbeknownst to me, work with a lot of agents. And you know how it works? It usually works how y'all feel, it don't work. 
Oh yeah, sometimes they get Negroes out of jail and tell them to infiltrate organizations and um, find out as much information. Sometimes it worked like that. But sometimes it worked just like this. A brother you know that been in jail, got a few records on himself. I mean, got a, a few charges on him. Um, we get him to, to, to rat on whatever, or we get him to disrupt a movement, or we get them to just, uh, 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 whatever you see, whatever movement you, you, you see that could have some momentum thwart it. And usually the participants come out of jail. That's usually where they get their, uh, pool of, uh, snitches and participants from. So anybody that's got that kind of bank uh, background is suspect. Okay? And then you have the pimping class. My thing is, I don't care about none of these people in name. What I care about is innocent people who believe in these in these people. And they're getting swindled and shyster because they really, really want something for their souls. But there is no shortcut. There's no shortcut to freedom. And can't nobody get you free. You have to free yourself. And in my opinion, once your focus becomes freeing yourself, Every individual out here under the sound of my voice, every individual out here under the sound of my sound of my voice, leave the military apparatus to the military uh, functions. But focus on yourself, getting yourself right, yourself together. I guarantee you all this stuff will fall in place just like a well-tuned machine. Like a puzzle with all the pieces that fit there. Ain't none missing. And we have to believe that. We have to know that. And stop being so quick to cut somebody down and call somebody an agent. When you yourself are very suspect in your behavior. And you taking advantage of people that don't know nothing. And I just had to say that. So with that being said, if you like what you hear, please like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you in the next video.